This instructional video demonstrates the general steps to assemble and install an evaporative cooler system. Before you begin, completely read and understand the instructions. This video shows how to assemble the main water supply shutoff valve and how it is attached to the reservoir. Apply a couple of layers of pipe tape to all threaded connections during assembly. Tighten fittings until snug. Assemble the main water supply shutoff valve and PVC fittings as shown in this video and listed in your instructions. Prime and cement all socket joints using PVC primer and cement during assembly. Follow primer and cement directions on their labels. The main water pipe length must allow for adjustment of the water valve, up or down, once the main water line is attached and water is turned on. Measure and cut the main water pipe from PVC pipe sent with the kit. Prime and cement PVC pipe and the elbow fitting to the water supply shutoff valve to complete assembly. Next, measure and mark the hole positions on the reservoir using the U-bolt. Use a drill and quarter inch drill bit to drill through the reservoir wall. Be sure to drill all holes above the water line. The water level will be below the top edge of the cutout in the drain trough. Attach the water supply shutoff valve and PVC fittings to the reservoir, using the supplied you bolts and hardware. Measure and trim reservoir tank lid to fit with addition of the main water supply shutoff valve assembly. Use customer supplied additional fittings and pipe to connect the elbow to the main water supply. If desired, use a temporary flexible water line, such as a garden hose, to allow for easier height adjustment during the setup stage. Main water line can be attached later once the water level is set. The evaporative cooling system installation is complete. If you have questions, please contact our customer service department at 1-800-245-9881.